Hey Pat, it's midnight and welcome back to my vlog channel. I am, uh, I feel bad that I've not been posting anything really except for uh, diet and exercise updates. The issue has been, I've not really been able to set a schedule that I can stick to. And the diet and exercise vlogs are pretty straightforward because I just review my progress and talk about what happened that week and stuff. Those have been easy to do and I appreciate all the support those videos have gotten. It's been really encouraging, but that's not why I created the vlog channel. I created the vlog channel so that I could talk about what it's like to be a Twitch streamer and a YouTuber, the things I go through, the ideas I have about growth. Um, the things I've shared, the things I've learned along the way. I think that I have come upon a system or at least a schedule that allows me to get everything done that I want to get done. Well, the issue has been really the diet and exercise because I am so exhausted because of the way that I've been pushing my body for the past couple of months that it, if I'm not like, doing the things that I need to do, the the extra stuff sort of falls by the wayside because I'm just so tired. I'm tired all the time. But I think that I've come up with a system that allows me to get everything done. And I wanted to share it with you and talk about one of some of the things that I've learned just in terms of setting realistic goals because that's been my real issue. I have wanted to do just so much with Twitch, with YouTube, that I I over I overcommit in terms of the amount of work I think I'll be able to do, and I'm just unrealistic about it. So as we go through what I've come up with, I think it'll become clear uh, where I've sort of drawn some personal lines in terms of uh, being realistic about what I can accomplish. Because the problem becomes, and, and, and I'm sure you've run into it as well, Pat, but the problem becomes you set unrealistic goals for yourself and then you don't meet them and then you feel like in your head you're falling behind and you fall further and further behind with stuff and eventually you just give up and scrap the whole thing rather than trying to be realistic from the beginning, set smaller goals and then try to build from there. That's how I've achieved success with the uh, exercise program because I didn't start walking 150 minutes a day. I started walking around the block once. That's all. And then once I was successfully doing that on a daily basis, I added a second lap around the block and then so on and so on and so on until I'm doing 12 laps around the block a day and walking over nine miles. That's how I was able to accomplish it in, in the realm of my exercise routine. And I'm trying to incorporate that into my internet entertainment uh, side as well. So if we look here at my YouTube schedule, it is um, at the top of the screen. Uh, I'm limiting myself to trying to release four Let's Plays a week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. The reason that I'm limiting my Let's Plays instead of releasing them every day is I've changed the way I edit my Let's Play videos. There's a lot more editing that goes into it. Each raw video is probably an hour and 10 minutes. So that's an hour and 10 minutes of just raw recording time. And then after that, it takes an additional two hours to edit that down to a 35 to 40 minute video. Um, and I'll talk more in another vlog about how I'm doing the editing and we'll go through, I'll actually go through one and show you everything that's involved from start to finish. But as a result of that, I have to realize that each single Let's Play video is going to take me three hours of just straight production time. And I can't 
do that every day. I just, I can't do that every day. I can do that Monday. I can do that for a video to go out Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. And that's for now, that's just going to have to be as good as it gets. Now, alternately Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday will be when I release the vlogs. So like today is Monday. I'm recording this vlog, which will be released on Tuesday. Um, as you can see the schedule, I try to do my recording in the morning. Now this is going to be my first week of doing the schedule. Um, and actually I, I had a couple of, uh, let's plays that I had recorded already. So I'm just, I'm actually a little bit ahead on that. I've actually recorded through the Friday let's play. Um, so that's going to buy me a little time to make this first week a little easier. But starting next week, I'll be recording the video the day before it goes live. That's going to be helpful for me and for people who are watching. I don't know if it's helpful, but I think it'll be nicer for people who are watching because if you record too far in advance, then if people give you helpful comments uh, in about either the gameplay or whatever, you can't respond to those for like a week because you've got so much stuff already queued up, ready to go. So what I'm doing is I'm trying to record just one video per day and record the day before. So like today, right? I am recording the vlog, which will be released tomorrow. Tomorrow I will record the let's play that will be, well, actually Wednesday and Friday. Those are already done, but Normally, right, what I would do is I would record and then release, record and then release, record and you get the idea. That is hopefully something I can maintain. Now, one of the things that I promised myself is I would take one day a week off where I'm not doing anything. That day is Saturday. Now, yes, I do have to record the diet vlog, but the reality is that the diet vlog takes like 10 minutes. I sit down, I go over my results for the week and then I'm done. So this probably is more like this with the entire process taking an hour, start to upload and done. So that allows me to have all of Saturday off, which works out well for me because Saturday is my weigh in day. It's also the day if I'm going to have like Penn Station or something as like a little uh, cheat meal, um, then I would do that then. And, you know, and it just gives me the day where I'm not having to worry about stuff. Sunday is like church and then the YouTube stream, which is going to start coming back this week. Um, and other days are just filled with stuff that I can't take off. I need one day mental health wise to like, relax and do me and hang out with the fam and do stuff. Cause really if I can't balance my obligations to them, in addition to doing all of this other stuff, then, you know, then it's, it won't be sustainable and the, and the schedule is just going to collapse. I'm, I'm planning on being done by noon. That gives me all afternoon uh, to do my lawyering stuff. And uh, I've also got other time frames if I get crunched, but I, I've been staying really up as far as my day job stuff goes. I'm pretty, pretty much ahead on things. So I'm able to get stuff done a lot faster because I've done a lot of prep work ahead of time. So that has been a huge benefit. Plus I'm able to work from home, which has been an enormous benefit to me. Um, so as you can see, my daily schedule, I, well, you can't see my daily schedule starts at 5 a.m. when I start extra, when I start doing my walking and I'm done by 830. Then I shower and do my, you know, morning routine -y stuff. And then at nine o'clock, I'll do my recording. And then after that's done and in the can, then I move on to doing lawyer stuff. And I find that that time of day, I'm pretty primed and ready to go. So hopefully the videos will be better or at least as good. I don't know, whatever. Right. So I think that this particular plan, it's realistic and it's sustainable. 
and it allows me to have daily content. And hopefully what we're going to see as, as we talk more going forward about like my goals for YouTube, my goals for Twitch, the numbers that I have and where I want them to be, all of this will sort of fall into place. In the next vlog, which is going to release on Thursday, I'm going to talk about setting my goals and my plan for growth uh, as an internet entertainer on Twitch and YouTube. So hopefully you'll check that out. Hopefully you're enjoying the Let's Plays. I would love to see you uh, at one of the Twitch streams. That'd be cool. It's always a lot of fun if you can make it Tuesdays and Thursdays, 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. Eastern. It's awesome. Anyway, this is my schedule for now. Um, if you are struggling, I suggest that you sit down and just be honest with yourself in terms of what do I want to accomplish and what can I accomplish? And I would, my suggestion would be take the idea of what you think you can accomplish and cut that in half, cut that in half and do half the work. And then if you're nailing that, add a little bit. That way you're doing something, the train's moving forward, but you're not burning yourself out. You're being realistic and hopefully you're doing what you need to do to get where you need to go or whatever, whether it's a YouTube thing, a Twitch thing, or just, you know, getting the garbage out on Wednesday nights. So this is my schedule. This is what I'm doing. We're going to see how it works. Wish me luck. I'll talk to you later.